Do you want to get much stronger using the gymnastic strings? Well, I'm going to share with you an awesome exercise modification to some common exercises that you're going to love. So I'm just going to get right into it right now. And I'm going to share with you the first one are your basic ring rows. So a row looks like this. So this is me doing a ring row just like so and if I set it up a little lower it can be a little bit harder but basically the lower you set it up the harder it gets right and the other option is is if I elevate my feet so my feet are raised it'll make it harder now the problem with that is if you set up at a park or you know you're somewhere where you don't have access to extra equipment to raise your feet and this is an easy exercise already well what you got to do is simply do the one arm version so basically i'm doing the ring row but with one arm okay so it's the same concept i'm stabbing the elbow behind my back and if this feels really difficult or unstable because you're twisting spread your feet apart and keep your hips up okay now this might be too difficult if it is you can walk back you know and then and then that's much easier however my favorite progression is is to pull up and then release and then just do a negative as slowly as possible so like this and then pull up with two and this will get you super strong and next thing you know you'll be able to pull up with just one very easily now the next exercise that you can apply the same concept to of just doing the unilateral one arm version are the bicep curls a bicep curl you start out like in the same position like you did with the rows right with your hips up and your back parallel with the ground but instead of pulling your elbows behind you your upper arm stays in the same position and you think about bringing your hands to your forehead like so so instead of this it's this okay and this isolates the biceps however again you run into the same issue of this exercise being too easy eventually so again you could do the one arm version and if it's too difficult you walk your feet back and then and then try that however my favorite way of making this exercise really difficult to progress the fastest is to pull up with two release and lower down as slowly as possible and whenever you do a negative you want to like try to be actually trying to pull up while you're coming down to really do your best at it all right so those couple modifications doing them one arm at a time will really build up your strength in just a matter of a few weeks or months the more effort you put into it the stronger you're going to get and it doesn't require any equipment. So I hope that was helpful for you. I have a program that I sell on my website that is a rings-oriented bodyweight fitness training routine. And a lot of people use that routine and this is one of those modifications and progressions that you can use within that routine. If you're curious about that routine or have any questions, please check the links in the description of every YouTube video that I have and you'll find more info about the rings routine. And of course, if you have any questions right now, you wanna ask me, just leave a comment. And I hope that was very helpful. And I hope all of you get super strong and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, subscribe, and I'll see you next time. It's hot. I didn't inhale or breathe during all that time. <laughs>